It was known as the war to end all wars. But unfortunately for many, it was the war that ended their lives. Over 700,000 soldiers didn't come home, but their memories will live on forever. Bertram Best Dunkley was one of the fallen, a husband, a father and a hero. We're commemorating Bertram Best Dunkley, who won the Victoria Cross during the Great War, during a battle which is now popularly known as the Battle for Passchendaele. He uh, was the commanding officer of a uh, Lancashire battalion, a uh, battalion of the Lancashire Fusiliers, who were taking part in the initial phases of that particular uh, campaign. Over a hundred years on, the battle is still remembered today and the importance of their sacrifice is still as moving now as it was back then. I think it's, it's vital, it's not just military history, it's family history. There are representatives of the family here today. It's, it's local history, the Lord Mayor is here today. So it, it's a history that belongs to everybody. And, and over the last few years, when we've been commemorating the Great War, people are beginning to realise that it's actually their story. It isn't somebody else's, it's their history, it's their heritage. We have to remember everybody who, who was lost in, in, in wars such as the First World War. Not just the ones who gained the awards, it has to be everybody and to try and prevent this from ever happening again. And in honour of the event, a minute's silence was held. We will remember them. <laughs> Wreaths were laid by the Lord Mayor, the military and by a member of Bertram's family. It's very emotive. Um, you know, it's amazing that the City of York has done this for them, but I think it's good that we remember what they did for all of us. We couldn't live as we do if they hadn't sacrificed themselves, could we? But I'm particularly thinking of my grandmother, who lived till she was 89 on her own. I mean, I think people need to be reminded of what people did, don't they? It's, you know, it is a good thing. And I think it's beautiful, isn't it? And it's been a lovely ceremony. From the bench, you can see the house where Bertram was born. A place to reflect on the sacrifices of this fallen soldier. Abby Walker, That's TV.